We have many excited fans who are in the audience here, and they have a few, they have a few questions for you. So we'd love to invite our first guest. Whenever we hear about Somalia in the news, it seems like it's always negative press that's coming out. Can you tell us about some of your favorite memories from Somalia? Um, thank you for that question. Um, well, I, the, the, the crazy thing is, with all, the, with all the violence that we know about in Somalia, which is real, um, my most prominent memories aren't of the violent years. Um, they're, they're of Somalia's culture, just the collective culture of this country. Um, a lot of people don't know that it's, it's a place known as, you know, the nation of poets, where poetry is primarily uh, the form of communication we use. So if you could imagine textbooks and newspapers combined, that's poetry in Somalia. Um, it informs our everyday life and uh, it kind of and, and everything about our history is coded and collected in the memory bank of poetry and so that was to me one of the most memorable things about it did you have a favorite poem as a kid um, well the, the truth is it's like having having a favorite poem is like in Somalia is like having a favorite um, kind of uh, meal or even like it's everything I love that yeah it's like it's just what we, it's so varied and so widespread that it's just, it informs everything. So it's kind of like not outside of the context of life, you know?